Hey everyone, welcome to TechScale. So today I'm going to tell you how you can, you know, check the health of your battery in your phone, you know, in your tablet or whatsoever you are having any, any device that have, you know, is powering by Android. You can check your battery health. Obviously, you know that batteries are made up of chemicals and stuff. So it's not 100% accurate, but it will definitely give you a fair idea of, you know, how much battery health is is in your phone or in your tablet right now so this method will work on all the phones whether it's your me phone whether it's your oneplus whether it's your samsung phone so uh right now android don't give users you know an a native access to the battery health but definitely there are third party apps that are available that can do that for you other than that only i have seen apple doing this stuff that they show the battery uh, let me just turn this dnd yeah so uh, only apple right now uh, gives people and the users the permission to check their battery health in their battery sections or whatever it is right so the app that we're going to use is it's called accu battery right so this is the accu battery protecting your battery health and with science so this app will definitely help you to you know get get a fair idea of how much battery health is available in your phone so a little time it will take to calibrate so right now i will test it on poco f1 right so this is a phone from xiaomi uh came two years back so other than that you can test it on your oneplus on your samsung so on whatever phone you're having it should be uh or what do we say it should be android for for that right so here you will get all the battery stats of your phone you know the screen on time the everything that is in your phone but for that to work you need to charge this phone from 0 to 100 or from whatever percentage that you are having for example right now i am at as you can see where is the battery percentage it's at 50 right so if i charge this right now uh, let's just let me guide you through the app first so this is the charging you know you can you can put an alarm on the charging section that or how much do you want to charge like this is at 90 percent now so whenever my my phone reaches 90 percent it will uh give me a notification that it's time to unplug the charger right so here clearly you can see it also gives you a lot of battery health uh what do we call it analysis plus advices what you to do or about what to do right so as you can see charging to 90 percent causes 0 0.40 cycles in in wear so what does this mean let me tell you first what is what are charging cycles right so an average battery you know a, a lithium polymer battery uh have charging periods of around like you can say 350 to 400 right so if if you charge your battery for that much of time after that your phone's battery will start getting degraded right so this is what the charging cycles are so yeah so other than that you you must have heard people talking about that you should not uh all the time charge your phone to 100 percent maybe keep it for it keep it to 80 maybe to 90 and you know once a week uh take it to 100 that that what 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 that does it actually saves the charging cycles so, so the lesser your uh, phone frequently gets charged the more more battery you will be having in your phone you know the better the battery health will be and the better the battery performance will be in your phone right so here in the bottom section you can see there is a discharging option so this tells you what is consuming how much of battery right now so here you can see per app usage in milliampere hours that is mh it, it is saying wait for measurements so this this will take some time right so first of all let's let's give this the usage access so for that you need to go to users access and click here right so this will give us the <coughs> battery usage and other, other stuff that the battery is using right so this app actually gives you a lot of flexibility to you know uh, get in touch with all the metrics of your phone so let's now now get to the important stuff that we are here for that is battery health so as i as you see there is an option called health here so as soon as i click on the health it will say it, it will you know give some reading stuff here and and you, you can just read it later so right now it won't show anything right now because this is the first time that i have i have used you know this this app in my phone so it needs some kind of readings you know to to check the battery health so for for that thing you actually need to charge your phone 
like three to four times or four to five times from you know at least 30 to 40 percent charging maybe from 50 to 80 percent 50 to 90 or 30 to 100 or 30 to 70 so after three or four charging cycles this 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 data will fill up right so what i will do is i will just plug the phone to charge right now and i will you know after some time i'll unplug it and there will be some reading and i will join the video from there right so wait for the other matrix i will just be in a minute so as i said that i'll charge my phone for a while and i will come back so here i am here i am and as i click on this iq battery pro you can see now it's showing the battery health so right now it's not that accurate so what you have to do is you have to frequently charge you know like four or five times then only you can get a near accurate reading that even that won't be accurate but you'll get a fair idea after uh, i believe five charging cycles you will have a fair idea of how much battery health is available in your phone so anywhere around 75 i believe that that's good uh, i read that in a blog post so anywhere around 75 plus is a good sign or maybe 80 plus you should take it otherwise below 80 and the 71 75 i have seen devices with 71 and 75 uh, they're not doing that great in the in the battery department of the phone right so th this was how you can calculate the battery health i'm again telling you this is not a you know the the best uh, metric to check your battery health or this is not perfect and this is not 100% accurate, but definitely, let me assure you that definitely this will give you a fair idea how you can check the battery health. So that, that's all for this video. And if you want, or uh, you know, if, if, if you want me to make video on certain topics, you can always uh, do let me know in the comment section so that I, I remain up to date with what you people are, you know, in, in search for definitely i'll try to make videos on that so that's all for this video and do subscribe to the channel and like the video if you found this video a little bit of helpful this will only help me to grow the channel more and more and this will help the video to reach more and more people right so that's all for this video and i will see you in the next one till that stay inside bye bye